Slat, you startled me. What are you doing here? Me? Well, I was sneaking away so that I could safely access my realm to do some housekeeping. Realm? Why, it's what that store is for in your pack. You mean to tell me that there was a glowing pointy thing in your pack and you've never even looked at it? <laughs> Heaven's sakes, my friend. <sighs> I suppose I can show you how it works. Follow me and keep quiet. I have quite a load of gems on me. Here behind these bookcases are as good a place as any. To access your realm, open a portal by taking your rune in your hand, looking at the ground, and right-clicking. A realm portal will open, and upon standing in it, you will be transported to the selected realm within a few seconds. Take note that any player will be able to go into your realm while the portal is open, and you cannot close it while inside your own realm. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Hey there, dude. Hey, what are you doing? Hey, stop! No! Ow! Ow! Ha ha ha! That's silly noob. Now, where's his loot? While death works the same way as always, falling off the edge will teleport you to the portal that you created on the outside of it. Player-owned realms are the personal realms of the citizens of Andalusia. They measure 17 blocks long, by 17 blocks wide, by 18 layers deep. These layers consist of the top layer being grass, 16 layers of dirt underneath, and one layer of bedrock at the bottom. They can be upgraded up to 128 by 128 block plot sizes. To upgrade your realm, Hold your rune and sneak right click while inside of your realm. A message is displayed with the price for the upgrade cost along with a confirmation code that you may type to accept. When you do this, you will be kicked out of the realm until it is fully upgraded. During this period, no one can enter your realm. When you hover over the realm portal, it displays your realm's tier and dimensions. Note, in order to meet the cost requirements for the upgrade, you must have the gems in your pack at the time of upgrade. Realms also include a store in which players can buy resources to build with while inside them. To access this store, hold the realm portal in your hand and up toward the sky, then left click. The realm material store menu opens with a list of available resources is displayed. Hovering over these items show the cost per unit of that specific item. You can purchase these resources with the gems in your backpack by left clicking on the desired item. A message displays prompting you to enter your desired quantity between 1 and 64. Type the quantity and if you've got enough gems in your backpack, the transaction will complete and the selected quantity will appear in your inventory. To cancel the pending transaction, simply type cancel. After all your shopping's done, you can break and place blocks without tools, just as you would in creative mode, anywhere within the allowed tier borders of it and up to 39 blocks above the grass layer. When a block is broken, it will be added to your inventory as long as you have enough space in your pack. If you don't, the block will not break and an error message will appear. While exploring Andalusia, you may have run across chests which you can find in the wild. Chests can be used in a player realm to store arrows, books, blocks, and items of all types. There are certain items that cannot be stored in chests, such as gems, the currency of Andalusia, weapons, and armor. Chests may be accessed by players invading your realm, unless of course you have blocks upon top of the chest. Players can protect themselves from invasion by digging holes directly underneath the portals. When this particular setup is in place, a player can approach a realm, enter it, and be instantly dropped in the trap, where there is no escape. Players may also craft and place the craftable objects in the realm as they see fit, such as crafting tables. Well now lad, it's getting late. Now that you are familiar with player realms, please help me get some of this loot sorted. I'm preparing for a most perilous journey into the jagged rocks within a few days. What's that? You'd like to tag along? Well, I suppose another sword would be welcome among the goblins. Prepare yourself then, for when we meet again, we shall meet as warriors. Farewell, lad, and good luck. <laughs>